Pregnancy comes with many dangers to the mother and the fetus. There are fears of complications and more fears that the baby will not survive. In the link provided, Dr. Benjamin Brenner discussed the effects of antithrombotic therapy on women who had clotting disorders. Dr. Brenner also mentioned that there is strong association between pregnancy complications and populations where clotting disorders are prevalent. In the next slide, I will provide an image of the content information, which was discussed by Dr. Benjamin Brenner. In a study where Dr. Brenner and his associate tested anoxaparin on women who were pregnant with recurrent pregnancy complications, the goal of this study was to see if anti-clotting medications would improve outcomes for the mother and the fetus. The treatments were started within 5-10 to 10 weeks of pregnancy and continued 6 weeks after pregnancy due to the high risk of thrombotic events in women postpartum. The study showed that there, before the anticoagulation therapy, their live birth rate was 26%. After, after anticoagulation medication was given, the live birth rate was 84%. This is stunning difference. I think it is very important to mention that this study was conducted among women who had recurrent pregnancy complications and clotting disorders. A statement was made in the beginning of this article that a woman with clotting disorders but no pregnancy complications typically had consistent successful pregnancies. If you would like to learn more about Dr. Brenner's discussion on thrombophilia and clotting disorders, please follow the link in the description.